This is the default portal that we get when we use Pega 8.7. So the Cosmos skin is used here. And if we would like to change it, we go to application, um, definition, and down here we see the skin and we can change it. Let's say we want to use flame. We click save and we actually have to restart the portal, user portal. And now our portal is red. So this is the flame skin. But if we want to create our own skin, what do we do? We go back to Dev Studio, we have our skin, we click this little gear or bullet or whatever. Um, we click Save As, we give it a name, My New Skin. Make sure it's in the correct rule set. Create and open. And now we see our default view. And we have a bunch of different ways we can change the layout over here. Let's say we would like to change the button, for example. I can see this is what the button looks like right now. And maybe I want to change it so that it looks like this. So it's purple with um, a crown color that is gray. So now it's gray. I just changed the border now. So now it's like this see-through and, and on hover, maybe I would like my background to be blue. So now it's blue. Um, I click save. I go back here and I change the name to my new name. I save. I launch the portal. And now our button looks like this. But it does seem a little hard to do it for every single thing on the page. But what we can do is we can both see the inherited buttons, so what they looked like before. And we can create mix-ins. So, for example, I would like it to be name, submit. Oh, I did it in the wrong tab. Um, they would like me to go back to the Cosmos skin to create the mix in. But we just give it a name and then we set the style and then we can use it in my new skin. The important part here is that if you're changing the skin and creating different colors and so on, that you make sure people with color blindness can actually see what's going on. And there are a bunch of different ways uh, to emulate um, color blindness and their extensions and so on you can download, um, but that's a good way to go.